Yo, yo, you guys. So I wanted to show you guys, man. Like you guys saw the bag earlier, but like she she really went all out, guys. I mean, um, I mean she really went all out. She really hooked it up, man. I mean, really hooked it up. Melissa, thank you so much. You're an absolute angel. You're an absolute angel. Just amazing, you guys. Just amazing, you guys. And she gave me the receipt also. Only reason why I'm going to hang on to the receipt is in case something's wrong. Um, but there's no way I would ever return this thing, man. Um, yeah, I, I really can't believe it, you guys. GoPro Hero 5. Brand spanking new. I haven't even opened this yet. I kind of don't want to open it. It looks so pretty. But, uh, yeah, so that's that. And, uh, yeah, guys, thank you very, very, very much. Melissa, Dominic, you guys are fantastic people. Um, as I said, anything I can do for you guys, let me know. And also, for all of you out there who come up to Big Bear Lake, check this out, man. Melissa and her husband, Dominic, own an Airbnb right at the base of Snow Summit. Well, they own a house, or they own a place, but they, you know, sublet it for those Airbnb type nights and stuff like that. So, um, I just wanted you guys to know that. And if anyone wants to stay up here in a really killer spot, I guarantee you their spot's badass. It's right at the base of Snow Summit. Um, and, uh, yeah, so you can contact me or you guys can, can contact her through my messages on here. But yeah, guys, uh, um, you know she's helping us out big time because I get to make these really nice videos now. If you guys come up here, you know, just mention to her, yeah, man, uh, I watch Nick's videos or whatever. Um, Big Bear Butthole, I mean, Big Bear Bonanza. <laughs> and uh, and he said to to contact you guys. But guys, like, uh, this this lady was sincerely a genuine, a genuinely good person. And, um, you, you know, yeah, you, you can get gifts from, like, horrible people and stuff who have the wrong motives, bad intentions. This lady did not. This was all, I, I could feel it right away. It felt really, really, really good really honest and very real um and uh so i'm willing to help her out any way i can so if anybody wants to come up here and spend time um and you want to stay at in uh, like a nice place let me know and i'll find out what she's charging i don't know if the places are ready yet but just ask your questions and i'll i'll uh i'll refer you guys to her um once again guys uh, you wouldn't want to rent a night or two from a better group a better husband and wife couple than this man they're just a, a phenomenal team they um yeah man uh, <laughs> so anyway guys thank you very 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 much this video is kind of like uh i'm not going to be doing any snow stuff on this video but i want all of you guys just just to really see like um how blessed i really am man i you, you know this is amazing i mean this is just absolutely amazing i can't believe it um yeah, Melissa, Dominic, dude, you guys are fantastic. I'm, I'm at a loss for words. I even cried today, you guys, like uh, when they were here or when she was here. She dropped it off to me, and it just, it just blew me away. I, you know, I, you just don't expect stuff like that. You know, people talk, people talk, and she actually followed through. I can't believe it. Um, and then also, guys, on another really somber note, man, we had a ski instructor die on our mountain today. She was like 70 something years old. I don't know what happened, but a friend of mine who works with me was actually up on the slopes and, and, and was there before the ambulances got there. Apparently she went over the edge. She must've caught a ski or someone ran in, into her and, and she went over, over, over the edge and it projectiled her head first right into a tree down the mountain. Um, guys, it's, dude, I, I had a really rough, rough day today obviously nothing like that family but man like just it's just been a really rough day i love all you guys please be safe up here wear helmets dude please if there's any reason to wear a helmet that's it this is a ski instructor not just a fucking random person skiing you guys it's a ski instructor died on impact today dude i i you know some of the stuff i heard was pretty pretty intense so i'm not going to repeat it here like stuff that 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 my friend saw, dude, like it's brutal. Just guys, please be safe. Invest a hundred dollars in a, for a decent helmet, please. I love you guys very, very much. I never want to hear anything happen like that to any of you, man. And this is a professional dude, a professional. It's sad, man. 
anyway, love you guys. Melissa and Dominic, thank you guys again. Um, you know, I'm sure you guys' Airbnb business will be fine, but I want to help you guys out as much as I possibly can because you guys are good human beings and you deserve it. Lots of love. I love all of you. And anything I can do for any of you, you always ask, let me know, and I'll, I'll try to accommodate you to the best of my abilities. Thank you guys very, very much. Peace out. The next videos will be about snow, and uh, or maybe not quite, because I have a day off before it snows again. I think I'm going to strap this to my motorcycle helmet, and we're going to take a nice tour around Big Bear Lake. Love you guys. Peace. Pimp, say goodnight.